my mom she's not in the car right now um she is actually this is very depressing at a funeral home right now because my uncle passed away back in april and she's picking up his um death certificate or whatever and so yeah but before i um that lady was like looking at me <laughs> um before i we came here i went to barnes and noble and i got a I went in the happily ever after. My Barnes and Noble, or the Barnes and Noble down the street from my house, actually had it out a whole week early, so I got it. So that's exciting. I was on the hunt to get that because I saw some pictures of people seeing it out early. So um, I went to a few places: Sephora, Ulta, Bath and Body Works. Um, the body shop stuff like that so I am gonna end up doing a haul video um, I think I might be hanging out with my friend Carmen later today I'm not sure but if so then I'll let you know what's going on but I'm here in LA not in the best part of LA as you can kind of maybe sort of tell but um it's home I've missed it I'm glad to be back so I will check in with you guys later bye I'm so tired so tired This is so cool. We made it to Santa Monica. Now just seeing this just kind of makes me want to make sure I go to the beach while I'm here. If just to walk. Oh. Hi Carmen! Hi. And like when people like can like live in those like apartments and like these places. So they're doing a cinema in the street right now. That's so cool. Well, oh, you can take a poster. For yourself. No, Cinderella. This is so cool. I'm to take any posters I went crazy when I found out there was going to be a Night at the Museum movie. Another one. <laughs> there you go. All you need to do is see the glass slipper. You know what's going on. I know. I was like, oh, shit. All right. Going into the Zip Barnes and Noble. Carmen's a happy girl. She got her Cinderella poster. <laughs> I'm really curious as to what movie they're showing up because I really like want to check it out. Oh. Inside we go. drugs I'm gonna get um, Bless Me Ultima by Rodolfo Anaya. 
but So crazy, like I don't even know. Oh my gosh, the wood is a little rickety there. Oh, these are encyclopedia. <gasps> Why do I feel like I'm gonna fall? Oh my gosh. This is so cool. I have no idea. These are like, oh, Shakespeare yeah. is here. I don't, I'm scared to look inside. I don't want to touch anything. There's Aristotle. Oh my gosh, Darwin. Oh, the Iliad, the Odyssey, Plato, Plutarch, <laughs> Hunger Games. No. <laughs> Tolstoy. Uh, this is so cool. I'm afraid to touch anything. Like, my fingerprints will, like, devalue these books. That's what it feels like. You're not in it. Don't worry. It's very, like, and I think that's what I've been hearing a lot about it, is that aesthetically, it's awesome. Like, this is probably the coolest room that we've been in. I may or may not get that, but yeah, let's go upstairs and see what's up there. I don't wanna die. Well, there's a hole in the books. So far, I really haven't found anything that I want to buy, but this is legit. George R. R. Martin. <laughs> this is an interesting book. I think I might be. It's pretty legit. Now I want to kind of go in this crime, law, horror, and weirdness space. And then this little book tunnel thing. You should get this. Uh, yeah, and it's a dollar. A dollar. Um, I, oh my gosh. In ca okay. Procedures to follow if accidentally locked in the vault. The will, okay. Is this like for real? <laughs> <laughs> it is not possible to open the vault door from the inside. So you go through this door here to the book oh. space. Okay, this is probably the best part of the story. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is kind of cool. Let's see what this is. Like, what is? Oh, they have black lights in here. Black lights. Oh my gosh, there is a black light up there. Oh my gosh, this is so strange. 
It's hot in here. It's hot in the entire time. True. Oh, it's because I was standing in front of the fan. This is nuts. Of course Stephen King is in here. Yeah. Of course. All the, all the horror stuff. I wonder what I want to read that book he wrote under the dome that one that's a TV show. But oh, is that is that based on a book? Right? Mm-hmm. Oh, I didn't yeah. There's Joe Hill. Joe Hill is weird. I'm reading his book right now. But that's the one with Daniel Radcliffe, the horns um, movie. He um. I tend to stay away from book. horror because my imagination. So yeah, funny. and I'm the weirdo that will watch horror movies in the dark at home by myself. Oh, yeah, no, I get and it's a bad idea. It's always a bad idea, but I, know it's a bad idea. I do it anyway because I'm like, I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. I was looking at those paintings right there. I know, and it's, there's a note from the artist right here. There's an artist statement. There's a chair that I almost sat in <laughs> that I probably shouldn't. Oh, this is really interesting. Here. 